Hello and welcome to the very first edition of the CodeCloud Monthly Updates. My name is Pumshad Manambath and through this series of videos, I'm going to provide you an update about all the latest and coolest things happening at CodeCloud. In this video, we'll do a quick recap of the highlights from the beginning of this year and hopefully going forward, I can bring you updates each month. We'll be talking about our newly launched courses, upcoming programs and webinars, community hours and lots more. So before I begin, here's a quick reminder to subscribe to our channel so you can stay up to date with the latest updates. One of the recent and most important course launches is the Ultimate CKA Mock Exam Series. Now this is a one-stop hands-on practice test for all CKA aspirants, a perfect addition to our CKA preparation course. It simulates the CKA exam environment as closely as possible, has multiple clusters that you'll have to switch between while attempting the exam, and it tests you across all the five uh, different knowledge areas covered in the actual exam. The best part is that the questions are randomized from a large pool every time you take the test. This way, no two attempts are the same. There are 10 different mock exams available, so check it out using the link given below. There's also a special contest that we are running where we are giving away CKA exam vouchers worth $395. So all you have to do is complete the 10 mock exams in the Ultimate CKA mock exam series and pass them and share your results with us using the form given in the course. Now we will reward you with a voucher to attend the exam for free. And these vouchers come with a free retake as well. Now, by the way, if you are preparing for the Certified Kubernetes Security Specialist or the CKS exams, we have a contest running for that too. All you have to do is crack the challenges in the CKS exam uh, challenge series and document and share your solutions. Check it out using the link uh, given here. And very soon, we're going to uh, release the Ultimate CKAD as well as the CKS mock exam series as well. So watch out for it. The next big course we released is the AWS Lambda course. This is the first of the many AWS courses planned for this year. In this course, Matthew Birch simplifies Lambda for the absolute beginners. We're introducing a new way to learn cloud services using a hands-on approach as you've seen with the rest of our courses on DevOps. You'll have challenge-based lab activities after each lecture where you'll be provided with real AWS accounts access and where you'll learn by exploring and building actual solutions. As with all of our DevOps courses, our cloud labs will validate your tasks and give you feedback instantly. As this utilizes cloud labs, you'll need to have the CodeCloud Pro subscription to access the course. In the upcoming months, we will add cloud courses with hands-on labs for S3, VPC, Code Pipeline, databases, Elastic Beanstalk, EKS, SNS, and certification courses like the AWS Cloud Practitioner, as well as the AWS uh, Solutions Architect exam. So if you haven't upgraded your subscription yet, now is a good time. Earlier this year, we released a number of courses. The first one was the LPIC 1 Exam 101. This course is designed to prepare you for the LPIC 1 101 exam. That's the very first step in the Linux Professional Certification Program. In this course, Aaron covers topics such as uh, systems architecture, installation, package management, commands, and more. Plus, you'll find a mix of lectures, quizzes, and mock exams to keep it engaging and interactive. The second course we lost is the Advanced Golang course. With this course, Priyanka helps you build a strong foundation in the core concepts of Golang. Earlier, we had released a beginner level course on Golang, and this one teaches you advanced skills about concurrency, modules, standard libraries, setting up a CI/CD pipeline, and beyond. The next was the AZ305 Microsoft Azure Solutions Architect exam preparation course. If you're looking to take the AZ305 exam, this course is for you. In this course, Ritin helps you get a solid base on how to implement infrastructure solutions on the Azure Cloud Platform. It covers a wide range of Azure services and technologies, including authentication and authorization, governance solutions, network architecture, non-relational data storage, data integration, architecting applications for the cloud, and more. A final mock exam at the end of the course will help you prepare for the multiple choice and the multiple response questions seen when taking the AZ305 certification. And finally, I also had some time to record a crash course on the 12-factor app. It will teach you best practices to build cloud-native applications using the 12-factor app methodology. And by the end of the course, you'll be able to learn the considerations to keep in mind while developing applications that are scalable, maintainable, and can thrive in the ever-changing world of software development. So check it out using the link given here. We also have some amazing courses coming up this month. A course on the AWS S3 with hands-on labs to practice, 
We have the GCP DevOps uh, project course. It's a project-driven approach to implementing DevOps principles on the Google Cloud Platform. Roku will walk you through the real-world use cases using a project uh, from start to finish. In quarter two, 2023, we have more courses planned, such as the Kubernetes and Cloud Native Associate Exam Prep course, or the KCNA, the AWS Cloud Practitioner, and the AWS Solutions Architect Associate Exam Preparation course, and the Azure DevOps course, to name just a few. If you have been following our YouTube channel, we released a number of videos recently. We shared some beginner-friendly videos, such as a starter's guide to GitOps and an AWS S3 tutorial for beginners. We also created a video on the must-read books for DevOps professionals, which is a series that uh, where we will review some of the most popular DevOps books. We also released a video on Kubernetes enhancement proposals or CAPS, a video on the difference between ECS versus EKS, and finally, a video on WebAssembly and how it is related to Docker. We also released a number of blog articles around trending topics in Kubernetes and Cloud Native. So if you haven't signed up for our newsletter, uh, please remember to do so. In the middle of launching new courses and making fresh videos, we also found some time to have some fun. Because in February, our team traveled to Bali for an all-hands company meetup. Now you may not know this, but CodeCloud is a fully remote team spread all across the world. So most of us had never met each other face to face. Last month, we decided to change that. We flew out our entire global team to spend three days and two nights in the beautiful Bali and it was awesome. We soaked in the sights, we bonded as a team, and we talked about how we can make 2023 even more amazing for our Code Cloud community. And that's you. This was the first meetup of its kind and we hope to do uh, many more in the future. And speaking of team meetups, we are on the lookout for talented specialists to join our growing team. So if you'd like to be part of CodeCloud, head to the job section on our website to apply for the relevant opportunity. We've dropped a link in the description below. And last but not least, we want to take a moment to tell you about office hours with community. If you didn't know already, we have a Slack channel with 70,000 plus members and growing, and this is open to anyone and everyone. So use the link below and Office Hours is where the Kotla community comes together to share and learn more from each other. We host two webinars every month and everyone who is part of our community is invited. So if you want to catch our upcoming Office Hours with the community, make sure to join our Slack channel for updates. We have shared the link below. And here's a glimpse into what's coming in the future for CodeCloud. This year, we'll be launching a new version of the CodeCloud learning platform to provide a seamless experience between onboarding, video lectures, labs, learning paths, and more. So watch out for further announcements later in Q2. We will also be releasing an update to the CodeCloud Engineer program. Now, if you aren't part of the CodeCloud Engineer program already, it is a free and gamified platform to learn DevOps by doing. We will have different tracks that you can pick from. We will be releasing a new and updated version of this very soon. So for now, you can explore the old version uh, right here using the link given here. And that brings us to the end of the CodeCloud monthly update. If you liked this video and want to see more such updates, give it a thumbs up and feel free to share your feedback in the comments. Let us know what courses you'd like to learn from CodeCloud going forward. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We release educational content every week. We'll be back next month with another exciting video. Thanks again for watching and see you in the next one.